Carson, Carson, come here, what is this? You got a stick, you got a stick. Oh my God! Oh my God! Tristan, what's going on? <gasps> Tristan! Tristan, don't fuck. Why'd you guys let Carson off the leash? Oh, fuck. Ari, are you okay? Oh, no. Come here. Oh, my God. Tristan, don't. Come on. Gus, you got to go. Did you see it? Yeah. All right, get inside. Get inside. Get inside. I'm gonna call the cops. Are you gonna call the cops like right now? I will call the cops. All right, just Tristan, upstairs. Come on, Jack's gonna call the cops. Let's the go. Door. Carson, go. Carson, go. Carson, in the house. Go in the house. Glenn, where are you? He's downstairs locking her. Is Tristan okay? Yeah, he's asleep. Oh, Sarah. Are you okay, Sarah? It's gonna be okay. Glenn, are you gonna call the cops? I'm calling you right now. It's gonna be okay. It's gonna be okay. I grabbed it! I know, it's I know. Nothing. It's gonna be okay. Hello? Yeah. Hi. <clears throat> um, you're gonna find this hard to believe, but I, I found an arm outside my house. We were, we were just out for a walk with the family, and my dog found an arm in the snowbank. No, there wasn't a body there. No, it was just an arm. And it was just blood all over the place. My dog found it, was chewing on it. Yeah. My name is Glenn. 20 minutes? Thanks. Bye. They said they'd be here in about 20 minutes. 20 minutes? Yeah. Alright, well, if they don't get here soon, you need to call them back in I'll a couple minutes. I'll call them back. Listen, honey. We live right Sarah, around the corner. Okay. I understand. It's gonna be okay. There's don't worry, it's gonna be There's okay. a lot of weird stuff going on tonight, and you and I need to talk away from the kids. Okay, but if they don't get here soon, you're gonna call back. I will call them back. Sarah, it's gonna be fine, okay? It's all right, it's gonna okay, be fine. fine. But we live, I just, I don't understand. It's, it's fine. It's gonna be fine. Okay. Can we go now, please? We need to talk. Now. It's gonna be okay, Sarah. I'll be right back. Sarah, it'll be okay. I'll be just right relax. back. Honey. We'll be right back. What is going on? There's no way there's a 20 minute response time. I know. Listen, we're not the only one to call in with something like this. There's weird stuff going on downtown. Like what? The, the, the two people who called just before me said that they found arms. And there's people missing all over the place, people fighting all over the place. The Emmeldorf and the Fort Ridge cops aren't responding, so nobody has any idea what's going on. But there's some weird stuff going down, and we need to get out of here. Where are we going to go? We're going to have to go down to the... We're on base, honey. If we're not safe. Either way, you need to get some blankets. We need to go get your mom, and we're going to get out of here. I'll get Tristan, you get the blankets, and I'm getting my gun. So we're just going to get in the car and drive? Until we find out some place to go. Maybe mom knows something. I'll call some other people. But we need to go now. So I'm just getting... Blankets. I'll get Tristan.
Sir, what are you doing? I'm trying to get my stuff together. Where's my phone? It's upstairs. You need to go get it in the van with Mom and Tristan right now. All right, fine. I'll go get your phone. Go Shoot. now. I don't know where any of my st I don't know where anything is. Go. Carson, go with her. Just get just get in the van. I want to go out there. It'll be okay. Just go quickly. I'll be right there. been sitting in this chair, boy? How long has he been sitting in the chair? All night? I don't know. I told you to watch him. I was already asleep on the couch. I went to sleep while you were still up. I told you to deal with him. I told you I was tired. Well, fuck. Daddy's gotta go to work. Daddy's gotta go to work. See you later. See ya.
Shot up. energy I think I think this I can safely say that this will be my final vlog I don't know what the hell's going on perhaps where you are there's been more news bulletins or something I don't know I don't even know how I'm gonna post this there's been no internet or electricity for about three days now all I hear is the howling the goddamn howling I know they're out there I can hear them through the vents. I can hear them on the roof. It's daytime. They've never been out in daytime before. It's always been at night. I know it's safe to go out during the day when the sun's shining, but not anymore. I've had to tussle with one last night. He nearly killed me. Got back in just in time. Anyway, I'm reporting. I'm reporting from the Santa Cruz Mountains, outside of San Jose. There's no point in going down the mountain into the city. The city's been overrun by the zombies. Creatures, I don't know what they are. I don't know what they are. I don't know what they were. They're certainly something from hell now. But it's been safe up here in the mountains. And I can hear them. They're coming. Did you hear that? Hold on. That's not it yet. If you get this message, send help. Immediately. Evening. So where are you heading? I don't know. Mind if I tag along? It's pretty cold out here. Are you serious? You just tried to shoot me. Well, 
I think you could use somebody with my skills in a situation like this. Yeah, and why is that? Yeah, okay. And we're back from commercial. Welcome back, everybody. I'm Rockin' Ron, following you in your morning commute, as usual, every morning here on WQRX. Um, oh, ladies and gentlemen, apparently we're getting some late-breaking news for you. Um, if I'm reading this correctly, uh, apparently the dead are rising from the grave and eating the flesh of the living. Um... Uh, it, is this a bit? Is this is this is this a bit? What what do you mean it's not a bit? What the fuck do you mean it's not a bit? Are you kidding me? Zombies? Zombies? Fucking zombies? What are, are you? I. Uh. But the same stuff is happening all over the world. Yeah. I don't know, dude. I've just been driving around looking for answers and. There's nobody to give me any answers, and the few people I do meet have shit for answers, so I'm just driving. I don't even have a destination. He's chasing my station manager around in circles. Uh, I wish I could say this was an amusing sight to see, but having the knowledge that that zombie will probably eat my boss in about two seconds, it's not so funny. And, oh, oh, and, yep, yep, there he is. There, he caught him. The zombie has now caught my station manager and is proceeding to eat him alive. Uh, oh my god, and apparently he brought a friend. Now there are two zombies, two zombies in the control booth eating my station manager alive. Uh, well, this is actually uh, kind of cute. There's a, a lady in the tramp situation going on with my station manager's intestines. Um, I sincerely don't know what to say, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, I, I do believe this is the end of Rocking Ron you're listening to right now. Um, I can't imagine that they're gonna not eat me next. So I think this is, this is probably the last you'll be hearing from Rockin' Ron ever. And I'd just like to say before signing off for the last time, uh, Shirley, I never loved you, and marrying you was the biggest regret of my life. Well, that's it for all of us here at WQRX. This has been the end of Rock and Ron you've been listening to, ladies and gentlemen, and this is Rock and Ron signing off. Started. Sweet. Let's get the fuck out of here. So I guess this is how the world is gonna end. Yeah. Shit. I tried to get on base last night, and uh, the way in was blocked off. They weren't letting anyone in. But the way out, everybody was leaving. So probably not the safest place to be right now. I don't know why you'd think it'd be a, you know, more secure than the civilian areas. But everybody wanted out. So. I'm not going in if they want out. I haven't seen anybody. I feel weird stopping at these stop signs, but yeah. I don't know. What if someone just happened to be driving out here? I don't know. It's just not worth wrecking my car. I need this car. I should at least see more of those things. We should go to Mexico. Alaska? Yeah. Oh shit! Oh, what the, what the fuck? fuck? Stop, the Stop the car! Stop the car! Get out! Get out! Stop the car! Get out! Get out! Get out! Get out! Fantastic, alright? 
two things have exploded in the last hour. Now we're out here, we're probably gonna become one of them. Oh, that's, that's great. Just don't breathe. You don't even know how you become one of those things. Just don't breathe. We're in the same air, I don't know, it could happen. Wait, what's that? What's that here? I don't even wanna check. What a slob. Oh, this will be nice. I hear something, we gotta get out of here. Come on, dude, come on, come on. Come on, come on. Something coming. Started up perfect. This thing. Well, there might be things inside. There so might you be. check inside? Yeah. Yeah, it, lo it looks empty. TV. Wait, I see a TV on. Wait, no, hold on. Whoa, who's that? Oh, God, he's got a gun. Oh, God, he's got a gun. Go, go. We got a car. That's where we need to be, though. I mean, at least it looks like there's a sign of people. I don't know. Something tells me all the big cities are probably filled with those things. I mean, they're spreading quick, but how are they spreading? I mean, are they just... Are these aliens? Are these insane people? I just... If anywhere safe, you'd think it'd be up here in the hills. I guess I should apologize for shooting at you. Whatever. I mean, I, I had never been real familiar with a gun. I mean, I always, I've always known how to shoot one, but as soon as I came home and it was just filled with those things, I just grabbed it, started firing away. I mean, they just kept coming. No matter how many times I shot. How about you? How are you introduced to all this? Oh. I don't know. I was working, and then... That's pretty much it. I mean, I, well, I... I had a kid, and my, my girlfriend. We, uh, have a house out in Peters Creek. And uh, yeah, they get they went there too. Saw my girlfriend getting eaten by like four or five of them, and then uh, the kid was just gone. And I looked everywhere; he's gone. I mean, this is just—I mean, completely unheard of. I mean, a mass attack by cannibals. I don't—I don't even think they're cannibals. They're, what I saw, they were just monsters. They weren't people. I mean, they were people, but they weren't people. Like It was the one I saw that told me they weren't people. His face was melted. He must have walked through an open fire or something. His whole body was melted. All his clothes were gone. And, I mean, half of his skull was hanging out. I mean, no one can survive through that. Right back.
drop the gun. Fuck it. Got him. out of here. Completely out of gas, dude. We're out of gas. Completely, totally. We're just going foot from here. finished anyway. Let's go after the other one. I got an army buddy of mine um, who is deathly afraid of zombies. And I'm not making this shit up. I mean, he's really 
He hates zombie movies. He hates the idea of zombies. And uh, even on like World of Warcraft, he won't even pick the undead character because it's too freaky for him. I've told him on many occasions that he's a tool and he needs to just snap out of it. I mean, the idea of a cell, you going on a cellular level of the cell dying or being dead and then somehow working again, that's like popping a balloon and then having it just be inflated somehow with a pop balloon. You, you can't do it. The idea of zombies and the whole theory behind zombies is horseshit. Why can't people get away? They just walk. They walk and they stumble all slow. Just take a bat and hit him in the face. You're done. You're done, son. Or, you know, get creative. Get a chainsaw out of the tool shed. Cut their fucking head off. Whatever you gotta do. It's not like they're gonna go, hmm, well, uh, I'm a zombie. And I'm stumbling all slow. But if I go into Google, maybe I can figure out a way to take over this human race. At least with other monster movies like uh, Frankenstein or, um, uh, you know, the Wolfman, all that, the classic stuff, there was some type of, I don't understand the, the appeal to zombie movies and how, abs it, you can't get away from a zombie, you're an idiot. Oh, my buddy Kurt. Hey, what's up, man? Hey, Steve. Yeah, uh, turns out zombies have officially taken over the world. Zombies have taken over the entire world. Yep. And we're all going to die. Okay, thanks, man. I'm calling Jason. Hello? Hey dude, uh, have you heard anything on the news? I mean, about, uh, about zombies? Yeah. You have. Mm-hmm. Like that they're taking over the world? Yeah. And that we're all gonna die? Yeah. Okay. Super cool, man. Thanks.
Name and purpose. My name is Damien, and my purpose is staying alive. Are you bitten? No. So what if I was? Hey! He said he wasn't bitten. We have a zombie infestation. We don't have time to be messing around, man. Zombies? What the fuck is a zombie? Shut up! I have a lot of time. The train's coming. Three guns are better than two. We got an extra rifle. What train are we talking about? There's not much time. We've been scouting a train full of zombies and it's on its way here. We gotta stop it before it gets in town. What? Come on! Ah, we are my shot. Don't worry about it. We couldn't get the bullet out, but it's already been treated. All I, I got an extra rifle right here. All you gotta do is point and shoot at anybody that's not me. Williamsburg, you stay here and watch the stuff. Ah, Okie dokie, Chuck. Did you hear me? Go! I hope you like your meat well done.
Ah!